Hi, I'm Sarah Cordes, and I'm faculty in the Department of Psychology and Neuroscience at Boston College, as well as Chair of Graduate Admissions um, for the department. I'm here to tell you a bit about the process involved in applying to our graduate program to hopefully make the process a little easier for you. As you may already know, our graduate program follows a mentorship model. So students are actually admitted to the program to work with one or two primary faculty members. Because of this, we strongly encourage students that are interested in applying to our program to first check out faculty websites, to read about their research programs, and importantly, to read some of their publications in order to learn more about the research taking place in our department and to identify the faculty member's research program that best fits your own research interests. Note only assistant professors, associate professors, and full professors may recruit graduate students. Lecturers and part-time faculty members do not have graduate students. So once you've identified a faculty member that you're interested in working with, then please, please reach out to that faculty member to ask whether they plan to accept new graduate students that, to work with them that year. Not all faculty members have openings in their lab every year, and we'd hate for you to go through the trouble of applying to the program only to be not admitted because the faculty member you listed on your application is just not accepting students that year. If the faculty member you would like to work with will be accepting students, then it's time to work on your graduate application. Our graduate application deadline is December 15th of every year, and we require your undergraduate transcripts, three letters of recommendation, and a personal statement describing your previous research experiences and your current research interests. Also, please indicate on your application which faculty member you're interested in working with so that we know who should be reading your application. We do not currently re require GRE scores, um, but if you're an, an international student and you're taking the test of English as a foreign language, also known as the TOEFL, uh, we do expect students to obtain a minimum score of 100 on the TOEFL for ac acceptance to our program. After you submit your application, then faculty are going to begin reviewing those applications right away, and they will extend the invitation to those applicants they would like to attend our graduate interview day. Our graduate interview day is held every year near the end of January, maybe early February. This year, because of the COVID pandemic, we will hold a virtual interview day over Zoom. Um, graduate admissions decisions are made soon after interview day, likely by mid to early February. I hope this was helpful. We really look forward to receiving your application and encourage you to please reach out if you have any questions about the program or the application process. Thanks.